There has been a whole lot of effort and energy going into the gear planning and the build of this bike. The bike comes stock build. This is a Cannondale Topstone Carbon Lefty. It comes with SRAM Axis. It comes with Eagle in the back. Uh, the bike is tricked out and, and awesome as is. And then I put a few finishing touches on it. Um, put a SRAM power meter on it. I put a super sweet pair of Zip 650B Firecrest wheels on it. Big plush tires from Renee Ayers. You know, it's a mix of speed, a little bit of all-day comfort, and getting rad here and there. So Vermont is in this just perfect form. So look in our backyard, like the place is just this green, lush paradise. And to go on rides around here, it's just it's stunning. A whole lot of sinuous, snaking gravel roads. Um, it's, it's non-stop undulation. You know, 31,000 feet is gonna add up over the course of a heck of a lot of hard, short hills. We're, we're largely staying rural, so you know it's gonna be out there. We're gonna be away from a whole lot of downtowns, and not that many downtowns exist in the state. It's, it's freaking beautiful. Then you know, frame bags have been a whole new ball game that I've never been part of, and so it's, I'm working with moose packs. So I got a super cool frame bag, I have a handlebar bag. There's a whole process that goes into the packing. I'm doing it self-supported, so as much as you guys are there in the car, I'm not going to be feeding from the car. And then you know, you gotta consider things that I've never had to really consider before, like, I am bringing a trowel and toilet paper because what happens when I need to take a poop? At 100, I'll probably want a cup of coffee. At 200, I probably want a real meal. And at 300, I guarantee I want a beer. What could go wrong? There's the mechanical side of things. Lights, you know, I'm, I'm anticipating my lights are gonna work. It's not necessarily going wrong if it takes way longer than expected. I wouldn't be overly stoked because I do want to get it done. I want to arrive and have a beer at, at beer o'clock. Um, and I don't really want beer o'clock to be 2 a.m. the next day. You know, the, the bike that I brought was perfect for the job. And to be honest, I thought I was bringing a cannon to a gunfight from the very get-go. I'm like, my goodness, thank God I have these big tires. Thank God I have the lefty kingpin. I mean, like, it was, it made a really supple ride over a pretty rough route. So expect, expect a whole lot of everything out there.